Hello guys, welcome back to my channel and happy November. I hope this is a great month for us all. Today's video, I wanted to show you my weekly food shop. I'm just heading out the door at the minute. It is raining, which is annoying, but I'm just heading out to go get my weekly food. And yeah, if you don't know, I follow the Fast 800 diet. So I do have a video all on that. If you wanna have a look, I'll link it up here. Um, but basically what I do is, it's a low carb, low sugar diet. So I've been trying to stick to it the best I can. I've definitely went way over the 800 calories many of the times over the past like few weeks and stuff, which is normal because you know, we can't all be so strict. And I think it's really important to not be so strict with yourself, especially, you know, if you're feeling like something, just have it because you're kind of just annoying yourself by just not allowing yourself to have certain things. Um, like I said, I have been sticking to the low carb. I definitely have not been purposely eating, um, you know, like bread and potatoes and rice and pasta and heavy carb foods. Um, so yeah, I'm actually gonna go to Lidl today just because it's super cheap and I don't see the point in spending so much money on food um, when you can get everything in Lidl pretty much for much better prices. So I'm gonna go to there. I will try and film when I'm in there. Just depends if how busy it is and also like the mask situation can be hard to like, talk and hear me, but I will definitely show you guys when I come back what I picked up. Um, what is this weather? I don't want to get out. So I've been sitting in the car for like 10 minutes because I'm waiting on the rain, but I feel like that's just wishful thinking and the rain's not going to go off. So I may need to just brave it and go in, but it's really heavy rain and I just don't feel like getting soaked. <sighs> Wish me luck. So this is a quick overview of what I picked up. I know it looks like loads and it is loads, but it'll do me like two weeks because I like to try and shop loads at once and then not have to leave the house and go out and get bits and bobs because I feel like you spend so much more whenever I'm buying pieces during the day. Um, yeah, so I'll just start over here. So over here is some turkey sausages. I haven't tried these before, but um, I just thought those on a lettuce wrap um, would be nice. So as I've said in the previous video, I try and follow the fast 800 diet, which is a low carb. So you'll see there's like no pastas or breads, um, pita breads, anything like that. I try and just have like meat and veg um, for my main meals. So these are turkey sausages. And then under that I have turkey burgers, which I like to put in the lean machine grill. So I just maybe put some hot sauce, some paprika, some chili, um, put those in the grill and they are really really good so they were only 235 for all four of them which is good and then here I have some smoked salmon so I love me some smoked salmon for a breakfast um, this is a peppered salmon so smoked salmon and eggs or smoked salmon avocado um, smoked salmon poached eggs you can do loads with it and then I got some ham um, I like to actually have so this mustard this is a whole grain mustard and I like to spread some mustard in the ham and roll it up and just eat it as a snack. Under that, I have some 5% fat mince, which I'm gonna make some spaghetti bolognese with. So I got these tomatoes here, chopped tomatoes with basil, and also some tomato puree and passat. So I'm gonna make some spaghetti bolognese without the pasta. And then here, I'll probably freeze some of these because I didn't realize I picked up so much produce, but this is uh, looks a bit gross, but it's lemon and parsley hot smoked salmon fillets and then some salami to snack on because I love salami and some olives as a little treat So back here. I have some blueberries um, Also as in terms of fruit I got grapes um, And yeah, that was the main bits of fruit because on this they don't recommend you eat like bananas or melons or um, anything really high in sugar so blueberries and berries and raspberries are the three main that they encourage you to eat so I got some of those um, I got a broccoli head and some cucumber in the back to have with some hummus so here is my hummus excuse my nails um, yeah so here I got some Greek yogurt so this is Greek with honey and underneath is just a natural Greek yogurt they do recommend you eat the full fat version but um, you have to weigh it out so I weigh out these on my little scales and I think it's just because the low fat version tends to maybe have more sugar 
I'm not 100% sure on the facts of that, but um, yeah, they're, I find them so much tastier anyway. I picked up some soy sauce. Those are some tomatoes. These are some chili flakes, which I add to everything. I love spice. I love chilies. That's the mustard. This here is a lazy garlic. Um, they were so cheap in there. It was like a pound, I think, for the lazy garlic, which is great. And then here's some bacon, uh, corn nuggets. I love corn nuggets. Like, as you can see, I eat meat. Like, I'm not a vegetarian or anything, but corn nuggets, um, they're just so good. They taste like McDonald's nuggets. So get yourself some of those if you haven't tried any. Over here, I have some curly kale, which I like to put in the oven um, with some salt and pepper and paprika and just every type of seasoning. And it's just a nice little side dish. And then I also have some spinach underneath. So I picked these up in the freezer aisle. Brussels sprouts with bacon. I just thought like they look so Christmassy and festive and would be a nice side dish to have. So what I tend to do is have either salmon or fish or salmon is fish, <laughs> salmon or burgers or um, chicken and then I have it with a side of veg so these just look like a nice side I also got some root vegetable mix which is parsnips and carrots and then I'll show you these carrots these look delicious now they do say with a parsley butter but on this diet you can have um, full fat things they encourage not to eat low fat so I'm sure that'll be fine once I just check the back of it um, I picked up some mushrooms because I love mushrooms with everything some lemons here so I'm gonna make the lemon ginger tonic so if you've ever watched Gemma Louise Miles or any her kind of vlogs she makes a lemon ginger tonic so I got some lemon and then I also got some ginger pieces here and you just have it every morning it's in a hot water I might put it in one of my vlogs to show you me making it but yeah you just put that in a hot water in a jug and then have like a shot of it every day so it's meant to be good for you I then picked up some butterhead lettuce. So this is one of my favorite types of lettuce. This because it's so big, so the pieces of it are huge and you can make them into sandwiches. So I have this as a replacement of bread. Um, I then just picked up some cheese, just standard cheese. And then because I know I have a sweet tooth, I got some dark chocolate. So dark chocolate is what they prefer, um, they recommend over like milk chocolate. So I picked up that, that will not last very long in my house. And yeah, I think that's it. I picked up seafood sticks just for snacks. Um, yeah, that is pretty much it. Like I said, that is, I know it's loads, but what I don't eat, I will freeze. And then I do find at the minute, it's much better to go out and do a bigger shop once a week or once every two weeks than buying gradually as we go, especially because I don't want to be in and out of shops a lot at the minute as well. So yeah, if you guys would like to see more, just let me know. So if you guys would like to see any more meal planning videos or maybe what I eat in the days, just comment down below and I'll definitely do that for you. If you have any questions on the Fast 800, not that I'm any sort of expert, just link them below and I'll try to help you out. Like I said, I've been following a few months now and those are the types of food that I would eat on a regular basis. So I just wanted to share with you. I hope you really enjoyed this video and if you're new here, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button. I would really appreciate it and yeah, I'm off to go make a coffee and chill because I got soaked in that rain so I'm just gonna go and maybe relax and take a breather. I'll speak to you in my next video. Bye guys.